Yes, Dimitri Bivol versus King Lyndon Arthur. It's going down. Riyadh season, 23rd of December. On the undercard of Joshua versus Wallen. You know, Wilder versus Parker. You know, they're the main big fights. So, Dubois versus uh, Big Baby Miller. Yeah, so it's going down. WBA light, uh, heavyweight title on the line. Arthur gets his uh, title shot, doesn't he? Um, his last fight, he fought Brian Suarez. And um, that was a tough fight for him, man. He went down, didn't he? He went down and he managed, he, dig, he dug deep. He didn't look like um, he wanted to be in there, but he dug deep and, and stopped uh, Suarez, the beautiful left, uh, left to the body. Um, yeah, you got Bivol, I can't remember who he fought last, I think it was the Mexican guy, I'm sure he fought the Mexican guy, um, and um, yeah, that guy, big guy as well, he was a big guy, wasn't he, it was supposed to be like a challenge for him, but he, he won He won easily from the highlights that I've seen, um, so yeah, he's, you know, Bivol's a man, you know, he's obviously looking to fight, um, he wants to hold the belts, doesn't he, I think the other guy is, what's his name, to BF, that's the guy he wants to unify, do you know what I mean? The division with, um, that's the fight he wants, you know. He's got to beat Yard, um, Yard, you know, not Yard, Arthur. He's always going to be favorite, you know. You know, he's an outstanding fighter, isn't he? He's beat Canelo, um, he's just you know, he's he's actually a good go record. He's beat a lot of like strong, like heavyweights, even if some of them were older, like Pascal and all that, but they were very strong. Strong like heavyweight, you know, big punches. Do you know what I mean? So he's a real deal. He is uh he is the real deal. Um no nonsense, you know what I mean? You've got on the card you've got guys Bivol and Jai Patai, no nonsense, mate. Just they're ready they're ready to fight, aren't they? These guys are just like fucking silent assassins, isn't it? So um that's what I like, man. I like them type of guys. You know, I like the guys who are outgoing as well. Um but these guys, you know, they're real deal. Do you know what I mean? He's a real deal. So Arthur's going to have a long night. He's going to have a long night. Um, you know, he's got to be prepared. Um, obviously, Arthur's got a good jab. Um, he's just got to be mentally there, isn't he? Because uh, Bivol's going to test him. He's going he's gonna to test him and uh, hopefully he makes uh, 12 rounds. Do you know what I mean? I think he's, he's got... I think he can, but... Uh, Bivol, man, he just depends. He might, he might go easy on him and just win on points. You know what I mean? So, I'm gonna go for um, Dimitri Bivol to beat Lyndon Arthur. I hope Arthur pulls it off. I have seen him the other day as well in in Manchester Town as on the bus stop. I seen him jogging, running, in the town centre. So yeah, it's Manchester Manchester lad. You know, I live in Manchester, so I'm supporting him and I want him to do it. I like I like the guy, cool guy. You know, he seems like a cool guy, down to earth guy. Um, I, I hope he does it. Do you know what I mean? Pat Barrett gym is really good gym. We got, um, what's his name? Zalfa Barrett. You know what I mean? And obviously we've got Lyndon Arthur in it. I hope you know. I, I hope uh, Barrett becomes a champion. I hope Arthur becomes a champion. Do you know what I mean? So, but you know it's gonna be a tough one for him. Hopefully he's ready, he's prepared. But you know he can't really go against uh, Bivol, can you? He'll probably win. He'll dominate. Probably win on points, do you know what I mean? Once 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 he gets going, he's a bit like Usyk and all them, isn't it? Once he gets going, he's just he's hard to he's hard to stop, isn't it? So yeah, I'm going for uh Bivol for the win. Hopefully Arthur survives. Uh yeah, Bivol on points, unanimous.